the hell's going on out here? Can't even cross the street to get to your home. You're inconveniencing the people that live in the community because you're not getting the respect a slave master and murdering thief deserves. Read this. You got to walk 900 blocks to get to the projects because he won't listen to the people. They don't think they've done anything wrong. The people are absolutely wrong here. They have no voice. If you see in something, you should stay quiet. Especially when it comes to these blacks in America. Huh. Interesting. Now they want silence. I'm trying to get back to the projects. I have to go all the way around all this bullshit. That chick up there, I know she's pissed. Just came out the train, and then you gotta go around their police headquarters because they have no 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 connection with the people. The people that work in the city, they pay the taxes. They have no connection with you. Your connection is give us our money and get the fuck out of our face. That's your connection. It's about the extent of your relationship. I think the morale is low. People are giving you your back. Part in their back, man. I saw that shit. That's the funniest thing I ever saw. That shit remind me of when I was locked up. They're part of my back, man. Show you how scared they are. They gave you that back. Mm -mm -mm. Morale is low. Morale is low. I'm out here in Spruce Street. People with AIDS Boulevard. There's people with AIDS Plaza. Crazy. Sure made America great again. This is great. That shit you didn't lie about. Brought back the good old days. Divided USA. This shit is popping. Just the right report, yo. It's not seasonal, it's going daily. A lot of shit getting wrecked. They built it. I guess they feel they have the right to tear it up. I don't know. You gotta talk to them guys that you didn't pay for 246 years. Oh yeah, that's right. You don't talk to them. You just collect from them. And I see the blue rising. I see trouble all the way. I have some advice for you. You should listen when people are trying to tell you things. Sometimes they're trying to help you. Not all the time. Sometimes. Out the hospital off my daybreak hiatus. COVID free sucker. Don't get mad at me. I live in the streets, nigga. You isolated me a year ago. <laughs> Good looking. Shout out to the city for not holding motherfuckers down while they homeless. Shout out to New York City homeless shelter system. The motherfucking blood suckers of the poor that money. That's why nobody's in a rush to go there. People are fed up with the lies. You gotta look them in the whites of their eyes when you're telling them lies. Oh, you won't do that. That's right. Six feet. <laughs> you gotta lie through cameras now. Through the tell lie vision. That's where you tell lies visually, right? Television. It's another on your ass production, man. Gonna make it short and sweet. We gotta find something to eat. Everything is closed. This nigga seemed to be a little peanut. Gotta walk 900 extra blocks to go to the projects. Now who's paranoid? Oh, what's that? People looting, rioting, stealing? Wasn't you looting, rioting, and stealing when you came to the continent of Africa for 246 years with impunity? No injustice there? No inheritance for them? 
No. Oh, it's beautiful for the blacks, no. They're blacks, right? Two thirds of a human. So you can treat them that way. The world is watching. No more talk. Under this block, we're gonna stop. See what you gotta say about this one. This is an on your ass production, Truth TV. Do you see what I see? Oh, P.S. a footnote. I hear they're gonna bring the military in now and start gunning down civilians. That's the smartest thing you ever say. I said you were masters of killers, destroyers of society. Let's see how many innocent people you kill on this soil again. We know you have no problem spilling innocent blood here. We watched you do it to the Indians, to the Japanese, to the Koreans, to the Palestinians, to the Iranians. Oh, you have a long track record. One you don't want to seem to take credit for. You know, you want to omit that part of your story. That's the dirty laundry you don't want to talk about. The shit stains in your drawers. Hmm. Looks like you got a problem. I don't have one. You have one. You've been had a problem. You got a problem from the day you showed up on our shores. You've been a problem ever since, and you continue to be a problem. And the world sees you as a problem. So what are you going to do about it? Are you going to change your ways? Are you going to stand up, take admission? Say, so, you know, yeah, we can change our ways. Because we don't see any change in your behavior. I think that's what the people are upset about. Stay tuned. True TV. It's just me. Just little old me. All the love, family. Peace.